Okay, Ryan with Reticulous.com. We're going to build a quick real estate lead generation funnel here. What we're looking on the, at on the screen is a, lit, a niche focused uh, list of properties, specifically pet friendly rentals in Chicago. And we're going to build an offer around this and generate leads really quickly using uh, some Reticulous tools and strategies. So first thing we always start with is we get this list together. Uh, I have it here on my screen in PDF format. You can get this out of your MLS. However you need to do that, fax it to yourself. You know, use an e-fax, get it in PDF format. Now we're going to come over to our uh, capture page builder. I have a lot of the fields filled out here, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and put my notification email in here, uh, the headline, see the list now for my submit button. I've uploaded my property list right here. Got to fix that typo. Um, and I put a fun background image here. I have a picture of a, a GIF animated image of a dog that I've uploaded here that's going to create when I build my pages, it'll be integrated into the page. So I'll click, get my updated links. I have a bunch of different versions of the page that are gonna build right here. Uh, I'm gonna use the simple with custom image. There are some other images, but I kinda like the way this came out. It's really simple, uh, free current list of pet friendly rentals in downtown Chicago. It's built. Um, there's our doggy sitting on the couch having a good time. Click see the list now, it pops up. This is very, very mobile friendly. It's gonna show great on uh, all phones and the person's gonna be able to opt in right away and uh, do their thing. So here's kind of how it works actually. Let me show you the process because um, there's something after the opt-in that you need to see here that's kind of uh, different about what we're doing. Uh, what we're looking at is a uh, second step survey that we use and which best describes you. I might be looking for a property to buy, I might be looking for a rental. In this case they're going to check rental but you'll be surprised. A lot of these people opting in for the rental initially may also check I'm looking for a property to buy up to uh, 1100 um, and in this metro we're probably talking like more up to like 1800 or something and then uh, they can check off they need financing or not. I should probably not show this field. I'm going to change that so it doesn't show if they check rental. We'll click complete and continue. And then in this case, it's just going to say go ahead and check your email for the resource. And then they're going to get an email from the agent with the list of properties. Okay, this makes them go check their email. Uh, it gets an action taken inside their email inbox so that uh, hopefully future emails from this agent don't show up as spam because the person's going to interact and download something, click in the email. Uh, so that's why we do it that way. Now, we have our page built. Let me go back to that here. Uh, I want to shorten this link. Up top I have a big gobbledygooky link. We have an internal shortener. Uh, and I've gone ahead and created uh, a shortened link here. Uh, AwesomeRealEstate.info slash pet friendly Chicago rentals. So if I go to that URL now at this point, uh, I'll go directly to that page and people will be able to opt in. They'll get what I offered and then I'm setting the stage for some easy follow-up because all you need to do is keep sending that list every week or so to those people and uh, if they're at all interested in pet-friendly rentals, great, they'll do that. But we also know that a lot of renters are going to buy eventually. So you're building a nice little farm of buyers here at the same time. All right, let's go and do uh, the most important step here. The We need to get some eyeballs on this thing, right? We need to start it all off, get some traffic going. So I'm in my Facebook dashboard. I'm clicking can create ad and I'm gonna do a simple send people to your website darn it Facebook <laughs> every time I log in uh, there's a different view here so don't let this discombobulate you but essentially we want to do the option it used to be clicks to website now it says send people to your website that lets us just plug our link in right here they caught me by surprise it said something different this time um, and then give it a second here it's gonna kind of like load the website it's moving a little slow because I'm recording. Let me pause. Okay, great. And then uh, now we scroll down a little bit. We're going to pick our target target audience. I didn't check with this uh, member of ours. So for now, I'm just going to do Chicago. He probably would like this to be uh, at least in downtown Chicago and probably specific zips, which we can do. So I'll come back later and put some specific zip codes in there. Who is likely going to be in the price range for the rentals? Um, you know, we're talking 1500 25 3500 a month is where he's going to be able to make a nice commission. Who's likely going to be in that price range? Probably everybody, but I'll cut, I'll cut it off at 25 at the minimum. Um, and then we have uh, everything else is kind of fine here. You can do some other demographic targeting. You can exclude, I think, people who already own homes. Let's see if we can do that. Uh, behaviors, residential profiles. Um, likely to move. Let's pick likely to move. I don't know actually that we're going to be able to exclude homeowners specifically. Um, so uh, we'll see. But anyway, we'll do 
Well, if just for fun, we'll do likely to move. That's 24,000 people. I don't know where they're getting that data, but we'll use it. And then uh, we'll do start this off at $10 a day for this campaign. $10 a day should get us about 20 clicks. And then a page like the one I, we just built probably will convert it about 20 to 30% uh, if people click and they're interested in this offer. At least, so we'll say one in five who hit it, about 50 cents. We'll be getting leads for about a dollar or two. Uh, tops, maybe less. I've seen this rental offer go really crazy. You get leads in the 50 to 75 cents range. So here we go. Uh, Ten dollars optimized for website clicks. I'll leave all that the same. Chicago pet friendly. Make myself a note here. Friendly. And then what I want to try to do is match my image for this ad to the image they're going to see on my landing. If we are getting fancy with the images on our landing, like I am here with the uh, funky dog dude sitting on the couch, I'd like to have that show up in our image if we can, in our Facebook ad. And then when they get there, it kind of looks the same, uh, hopefully. So let's just see if that works. Okay, took a second, but there he is. He loaded up. Uh, we're going to choose a Facebook page. Now, generally, most of us are going to have a Facebook page. Uh, I'm not remembering what Gino's uh, page is here, so I might have to come back and change this later. Um, I'm just going to use one of our generic pages for now. We'll use our Real Estate Deal Depot page. It's good to use a generic page name as we talk about with members all the time, not your name or something really branded here. Uh, pet Friendly. Friendly. Chicago rentals now <sighs> pet friendly rentals so I might have to get I'm gonna take Chicago out remember I, I ran up against the limit in their headline like pet friendly rentals uh, looking for a pet friendly rental in Chicago and I'm gonna get a little cute here uh, click Click to see a current list. Uh, click to see a current list, and and uh, click to see see what Fido is up to, and download. I'm getting too cute. Click to see a current <laughs> list. Okay, and then we can do our advanced options here down below. Uh, after you click, you can see what Fido's doing on that couch, plus access the current list of downtown Chicago pet friendly rentals. Okay, so I'm selling the click a little bit. You don't have to go that little extra step here. You don't even need this, this advanced options, but sometimes it helps if you can get away with it. So pet friendly rentals, looking for a pet friendly rental, rental in Chicago, click to see a current list. Uh, button, uh, I'm gonna do learn more here. Should put a nice little learn more overlay. We've got our awesome real estate.info showing up there. Good stuff, and I'm gonna let this run. A lot of times we like to do a campaign just for mobile and a campaign just for desktop. Sometimes it helps. Uh, our conversion numbers, but we're trying to get a broad sense here about whether this campaign is going to work, this offer. It's a little bit of outside of what we normally do. I know from past experiences this is probably going to work pretty good, so let's just get this test out the door and not overthink it too much. Place order. Boom! Okay, so in about 10 minutes, we've come up with an idea, um, an angle. We've created a property list to deliver. We've used a, the reticulous um, squeeze page builder, and we've run an ad that within the next uh, within the next probably 15 or 20 minutes we'll be live and getting traffic to this page. It's conceivable that this agent will see some initial leads within a half hour or an hour from this uh, and this campaign may be enough alone, even though it's just rentals, this campaign may be enough alone to fuel a whole practice. Because if you think about it, you can toggle this on and off at any time, generate five to ten fresh leads a day, uh, and a lot of these people are eventually going to buy a house and at the very least, in big metro like Chicago, you can make a healthy income just getting the, f the fee listings here, uh, the fee rentals. The rentals, you know, the, the commission sides on a nice $2,000 rental can keep you fed, uh, especially if you need a quick commission. 
quick deal here if you're in a pinch and don't have a lot of inventory or buyer activity going on. So anyway, thanks for watching. If you're not already a member of Reteculus, you should join. We're doing stuff like this every day. It's really cool. It's really fun. You're going to learn a lot about marketing, plus get all the tools you need to get some immediate impact going within your real estate practice.